Titan's the big massive truck behind me. I thought it was super cool. I went round it. I love how what you've done is used Raspberry Pi in really meaningful ways that like here educators, but I'm sure young people too, can use that as an inspiration for what they might do with Raspberry Pi. I think it is actually more interactive than it used to be and the, the kids are just going to love being in it and immersing it but importantly it actually tells the story of real careers, real work and I think that's important for our school children to be thinking about what they're going to be doing when they um, you know, go into either education or training, apprenticeships or university. It was really good, it had a lot of different stuff in there, all the robotic stuff, all the different things, the components that are in there, the VR game as well. I think it would be a really good way to kind of get young people to understand how, how a lot of what they're doing maybe in school now will relate to some of the jobs that they might be able to go into. So yeah, it's a really cool lorry. <laughs> it's great to see the truck again. The last time I saw it, I saw it from downwards, bird's eye view as I flew over it, so uh, it's great to see it here, it's fun to see it inside a building. Uh, I think it's a great facility, um, I think you've done a great job kind of packing all of that kind of RS magic into one, one container like that, so it's great to see it. Well I think it's unbelievable, it's exactly what we need, it's so interactive, you can see the excitement and inquisitiveness of people in there, and actually not just for kids, but for the adults that are here as well looking at things. It's a wonderful showcase, and again, on what this part of modern engineering is. And these kind of things really do make a difference, I think, to capture people's imagination. I, I, I think a really interesting part of this event then is going to be around how to encourage a whole new generation into engineering. I think for too long, engineering has been maybe seen as something like, like the, I don't want to sound rude, but the guy who, or, or girl who comes to fix your washing machine is called an engineer, as with somebody pioneering the you know, heads-up display system for the F-35. That, that's the same word is applied to those two disciplines. I think there needs to be, like you see on the continent, frankly, even more, I suppose, respect given to what engineering can do. Everything around us is delivered by engineering, and I'm hoping a whole new generation kind of realizes that, and I guess events like this will help.